Hello, good evening. Hello, teacher, good evening. Good evening, good evening teacher. Hello, good evening. Hello. How are, how are you doing today? What ha Tell me something that you did today. Something special. Nothing? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, in my case, uh -huh. I went to the supermarket because I bought uh, the food. Mm -hmm. uh, I went to the pharmacy mm -hmm. because I bought some medicine for my father, for my mm -hmm. father, sorry. And then I returned my house around that uh, yes. 1 p.m. Did you see a lot, of, a lot of traffic? Was there a lot of traffic? Uh, no, but, my, but the supermarket near to my house, uh, uh -huh. around two or three blocks uh, from my house to, to the supermarket, the mall of the Las Terrazas. Um, in the afternoon, I take some minutes because I check my uh, plat my homework and the platform and I study a little bit. Okay, okay, very good. So you did a lot of activities. That's good. Yes. And so it's not every day we go outside, right? No, <laughs> in my case, only on Thursdays uh -huh. and Monday. Yes, that's good. Excellent. Anybody else did something exciting today? No sé, armaron un rompecabeza. In English, you say puzzle. Puzzle. Uh, maybe you play video games. I don't know. What did you do? You watch a movie? Uh, I, I made a, a, a dessert. Oh, okay. Cooking. You were cooking? Yes. Uh -huh. Ah, nice. Uh, uh, with the, the ice cream, uh, uh, plain ice cream. Okay, okay. And with ron compasas. Nice. Okay. Interesting. So, yeah. did, did you see that on YouTube, the recipe? Uh, uh, the, the recipe, I feel, I, I, I see it in, I saw it in, in, in Instagram. Ah, okay. And you did it. Yeah. Ah, very good. So we're discovering abilities. Yes. Yeah. A lot, a lot of people are discovering yeah. abilities that they have. What else? One more person. Another person did something, something exciting, something interesting. I just bought, uh -huh. I just bought some things for the Mother's Day, and also it's the, the birthday of my mother, so it has okay. to be an special gift. Good, good. You you went outside to buy it? No, I just received a package. Ah, okay, good. All right, yes. excellent, interesting, very good. So I am, uh, I am learning more about Zoom, more about teaching, uh, different tools. Hay muchas herramientas. Hay a, a lot of different tools that you can use for teaching. So, me estoy capacitando <laughs> because this is going to be the future, right? Teaching like this or learning like this or working online, teaching online, learning online. And we're going to do this, okay? A lot, a lot of, uh, this is how we're going to do, use technology. Okay, very good. So, aprendan todo lo que puedan. De todo el uso, uso de herramientas, de cómo trabajar en línea, cómo, cómo hacer todo, todo. Um, Trátenlo, aprender lo más que puedan. Okay, very good. So, in English, we say, there's a term that we say, cutting edge. Do you understand that term? Se lo voy a escribir en el chat. Cutting edge. Es, es, es una frase. Cutting edge. Have you ever heard that, that uh, term? And some people, uh, when they're talking about technologies, they say cutting edge technology. Okay. 
What does that mean? ¿Qué quiere decir eso? Okay. That means the, the most recent, the most important, the most relevant technology that we have. Okay. Um, so now we have to learn these tools, right? Now we have to learn these tools. Eh, tenemos que aprender cómo usar Zoom, varias aplicaciones en línea, cómo trabajar desde el teléfono, cómo trabajar de la computadora. We have to learn these things, right? So we are living in cutting edge technology, right? Eh, and Clara, la ciencia, pues la medicina está mucho más avanzada, right? But we are using this now, right? We are using these tools. Okay, very good. So let's go to the lesson that I have for you today. Today we're going to learn. Let me share my computer with you, okay? Uh, this is the presentation that I have for you. I want to show you the presentation first. Ahora vamos a trabajar un poquito diferente. Presentation first and then the video, okay? Because uh, I think I can explain it and, and put a foundation, okay? What we're going to use is a word to respond in agreement, okay? Words to respond in agreement. I have a conversation here. Hay tres personas, A, B, C, three people, okay? So um, I want to uh, give you this conversation. The first person says, I am tired of watching news. Another friend, another person says, really? So am I. Another person says, yeah. Me too. Okay. Do you see these words here? Do you see these words? Uh, let me draw. Uh, so and two. Do you see these words? In English, we can use this to respond. Yeah. So this is a short respond to what the person is saying. The person is saying a statement. Muchas veces podemos eh, obtener una respuesta sin hacer una pregunta. Simplemente dando una opinión o un statement. For example, I am tired of watching the news. It's a statement. Is it a question? No, verdad? No una pregunta. I am tired of watching the news. So another person says, really? So am I. Yeah, me too. Both of these people are agreeing. Están de acuerdo. Both of them. Okay. Están de acuerdo con el statement. Okay. So we can use so and to. Otro uso de to. ¿Verdad? Este to, T-O-O, -O, tiene varios usos en el idioma. Eh, ¿Se acuerdan cuando lo usamos para de describir algo que es demasiado? ¿Ok? Uh, this tea is too sweet. ¿Remember? ¿Se acuerdan cuando yes. lo usamos? T-O-O -O, lo usamos para describir algo, decir demasiado, suficiente, mucho. This tea is too sweet. This coffee is too hot. Do you remember? Lo usamos. Pero aquí lo vamos a usar de otra forma. Lo vamos a usar para eh, responder en una forma eh, de acuerdo con una persona. So, this person's here. Todos están en, en acuerdo. El, el, el primer speaker, el segundo y el tercero, todos están de acuerdo. All right, so we're going to use four words. Vamos a usar so, to, either, Neither. We're going to use that. Repeat. So, to, neither, either. 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 So, to, so, to, to either, 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 neither. 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 Very good. So, the first two, las primeras dos, are for agreement. The second words are for disagreement. Okay. So the first ones are for agreement. The second ones is for disagreement. Okay, so let's go to the next example. All right. Let me erase. Okay, let's go to the next example. 
aquí está. Ok, so I'm going to use so and two. Ok, now I need three people here. Nineve, you're going to be A. Ana, you're going to be B. And Ivo, you're going to be C. Ok, only okay. read, only read what's there. Ok. okay. I am looking forward to going back to work. Really? Me too. So I am. Okay, very good. So you can, in this case, use to and so for agreement. Sure. Okay, todos están de acuerdo aquí, los tres. All right, very good. Now you can also use to and so uh, for questions. Um, okay, let's see who else we have. Uh, Diego, you're going to be the first one. Perdón, aquí me equivoqué. This should be A, B, C. Okay, so Diego, okay. You're, going, you're going to be the first one. Uh, William, está ahí? You're going to be the next. Tú vas a leer este. And uh, Jose Luis, you're going to be C. Okay. I could read it. Go for same Chinese food right now. I can yes, really go too. for some Chinese food right now. Repeat one more time. Some repeat some. I could really go some go for some Chinese food right now. Yes. What is the person saying, Diego? ¿Qué está diciendo? Uh, yo in Spanish. Ajá. Uh -huh. No tiene que traducir literalmente, solo lo, la idea principal. Ok. Que podría ir por comida en este, eh, eh, china en este momento. Yeah, so she's hungry, right? They want yeah. to go eat. So, very good. And next person, William. Yes, me too. Jose Luis. So, can I? Yes. So this is different ways of saying it. Okay, I want you to see something. Tu, T-O-O, va al final. So, va al principio. Okay, do you see? Okay, quiero que vean otra cosa también. Do you see this verb? Could. Okay, es el mismo verb que voy a usar aquí. It's the same. Solo que aquí está en el presente. This is in the past. Okay. So, voy a usar, ¿cómo se llaman esto? Se llaman modal verbs. Okay. Pues vamos a usar el mismo modal verb. Okay. Very good. Questions. Ahora vamos a either and neither. Okay. Repeat. Either Neither. Either, either, neither. 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 Very good. So, uh, let's. I'm going to read it. It says, I don't like scary movies. Me either. Neither do I. Do you see? Donde va either al final? Donde va neither at the beginning? And I use the same verb, right? In este caso es un verbo auxiliar, but I use the same one. Do you see? The same. The same. Okay. Repeat one more time this conversation. I don't like scary movies. I don't like scary movies. Don't like scary movies. Me either. Me either. Neither do I. Neither, Neither do I. Do I. Okay, either al principio, neither al final. Okay, very good. One more example. Disagreement. Okay, aquí estamos desacuer en desacuerdo. Um, I don't feel like working out today. I don't either. Neither do I. I don't feel like working out today. I don't either, neither do I, okay? Do you see? Uso el mismo verb do, lo uso aquí, okay? Now, quiero que vean algo también. Either, cuando uso either, lo uso al final y el verbo no cambia. No hay cambio, ¿verdad? 
Simplemente lo bajo. ¿Ok? Cuando uso neither, va al principio. Y uso el verbo, si era negativo, lo cambia a positivo. Do you see? Ya lo, ustedes lo van a practicar. ¿Ok? Les voy a pasar esta presentación aquí. Voy a tomar unas capturas de cuadritos para ejemplos. ¿Ok? Ahora vamos al video. Lo hice diferente porque el video eh, está un poquito, se limita un poquito en cuanto a la explicación, pienso yo. Si ustedes entienden el video, excelente. Si, le, si me entendieron a mí mejor, excelente. No importa qué vía usen, el, el, la meta es que, que lo entiendan, ¿verdad? Ok, let me exit, let me get out of here. Let me go to English Corporativo. I want to show you now the video. Alguien ya lo vio? 2.9? Yes, I okay. see that. Okay, very good. Uh, 2.9. Um, no, it's not 2.9, it's 3.3. Uh, okay, yo sé que me estoy adelantando un poquito, pero es la la gramática para las lecciones que vienen. Ok, so, recuerden, to and so for agreement. Neither, either, disagreement. Please agree with me in the following statement. <laughs> okay. Very good. Now we'll teach you when to use each. Try to make sense of what you... Hi, did you copy the agreement words? Very good. Now we'll teach you when to use each. Try to make sense of what you see on the following chart. Don't go as we'll walk you through the use of so, to, neither, either, and more examples. So, to, neither, either. I like Japanese food a lot. So do I. I do too. Really? I don't like it very much. I'm crazy about dessert. So am I. I am too. Oh, I'm not. I can eat really spicy food. So can I. I can too. Really? I can't. I don't like greasy food. Neither do I. I don't either. Oh, I like it a lot. I'm not in the mood for Indian food. Neither am I. I'm not either. Really? I am. I can't stand fast food. Neither can I. I can't either. Oh, I love it. Okay, solo quiero, eh, solo quiero notar, si ustedes ven, eh, los que están en la izquierda, que es decir, eh, so and to, están las oraciones al inicio en positivo. Neither and either, los ejemplos a la derecha, están todos en negativo. Don't, not, can't. Ok. So eso es una, una nota. Can I? I can't either. Oh, I love it. The use of to and so to agree with something being said to us. In English, we can use to or so in short answers to show we agree with something or someone. Notice we use the auxiliary verb of the short answer of the statement being said to us. For example, I am hungry. I am too. So am I. I love apple pie. I do too. So do I. I can play chess. I can too. 
so can I. The position of two is right at the end. Follow me. Subject, auxiliary, two. The position of so is right at the beginning. Follow me again. So, auxiliary plus subject. Now let's study the use of neither and either. To show agreement with negative statements, we can use neither and either. We also use the auxiliary verb of the short answer of the statement. Pay attention to the following. We use the negative auxiliary when we use either and the positive auxiliary with either. Follow the examples. I am not hungry. I am not either. Neither am I. I don't dance salsa. I don't either. Neither do I. I can't swim. I can't either. Neither can I. I'll leave you with the formula so you understand it better. Subject plus negative auxiliary plus either. Notice either goes at the end. Neither plus positive auxiliary plus subject. Notice neither goes at the beginning. Please agree with me in the following statements. Write your responses on our discussion box. I like ice cream. I am happy. I love pizza. I can't swim. I don't like French. Okay, very good. Did you understand that part? I like ice cream. Did you guys understand it, verdad? El uso de so and to, either, neither, okay? For example, si yo digo, um, this is, you can give me your opinion. Uh, I love ice cream. I love to. I love it too. Uh -huh. And what else? Alguien más? Yeah. I use so too. Very good. Y el uso de so? So do I. So do I. Very good. Ya lo voy a escribir. So, para que tengamos ese... Ya voy a buscar a, a word. Permíteme. Estoy tratando de salir de Microsoft para ir a, a word. Ok. So, escribamos algunos ejemplos. Solo para practicar eh, la estructura y después vamos a practicar el speaking. Ok. So, you respond... For example, I say, I can't swim. Algunas personas no pueden nadar. <laughs> right? <laughs> deberían. Todos deberían de aprender. All right. I can't swim. How can you respond? Neither do I. Ah, very good. ¿Por qué usaste neither y no te fuiste por so or to? This because it's, it's more easy to say neither, <laughs> neither do I. It's more mm -hmm. quickly. Sí. No. Eh, ¿Por qué no usaste so or to? Because, because ah, because it's disagreement. It's a disagreement. Yes. <laughs> it's because negative. En realidad lo que te yes. aquí es the negative, right? Yes. I can't swim, right? Neither. Ah, pero aquí do. usamos then, do, or can. Neither yeah, can, can I. I. Sería mejor can, ¿verdad? Simplemente usando el mismo verbo auxiliar que están usando ahí. O el mismo modo, verb. Neither can I. ¿Ok? Podemos usar either. Sí, ¿verdad? ¿Cuál es la otra palabra? I can't. I can't either. Eh, I o sería can't. I don't either. No, I can't. I can't. I can't. Ajá. Te, sería... Igual, sería eh, lo que tú estás usando aquí. Este, o del modo. El modo verb. Uh -huh. Sería el mismo modo verb. Ok. Creo que sí, sí mi pantalla está, ahora está en inglés. Ok. Very good. I can't swim. Neither can I. I can't either. All right. Very good. Very good. Another statement. Another statement that I can give you. Um, algunas personas... Eh, bueno, de hecho aquí tengo una foto. Estaba, estaba viendo algunas cosas que a las personas les gustan. Ok. Some people, some people don't like sushi. 
If I say, I don't like sushi, what can you say? Puedes usar me too? No, ¿verdad? Va, no. Eh, va, puedes usar puede, disagreement, correct. I don't like sushi. What can you say? Neither do I. Neither do I. Very good. Okay, this one's better. This is a better example. I am a pupusa lover, or I love pupusas. So am I. So am I. Uh -huh. So va al principio, very good. Y tú va al final. I am a pupusa lover. ¿Y usted está de acuerdo conmigo? You want to use two? I am too. Uh, you can say I am too or me too. Both are correct. Me too. I am too. Both are correct. Two va al final. Okay. So va al principio. All right. What about this one? Some people like octopus. Otras personas no. I don't like octopus. I don't like either. And uh, I don't like either or neither. No, either. No. Either but uh, you can say Ah yes, yes, correct. I don't like it either. I don't like it either. Very good. What about neither? How can you neither use neither? Neither do I. Neither do I. Okay. Very good. So, so you go, you're going to do some examples. Okay. Creo que ya. Esta es la conversación anterior en el eh, 3.2. Okay. So, in this conversation here, they use either and neither. Okay. Say, would you like to go out for dinner tonight? Sure. Where do you want to go? Well, what do you think of Indian food? I love it, but I'm not really in the mood for it for it today. Yeah, I'm not either. Okay, I guess it's a bit spicy. What is spicy? Chile, right? Pica. Mm, how do you like Japanese food? I like it a lot. I do too. Aquí está el uso de too. I know a nice Japanese restaurant near here. It's called Iroa. Oh, I've always wanted to go there. Terrific, let's go, okay? So this conversation is about restaurant, deciding food. Where are you gonna go eat with your friend, okay? We're going to do an activity like this, okay? Entonces una persona de una sugerencia, hey, Let's go eat, um, let's go eat sushi. I love sushi. Uh, me, I, I love sushi, uh, so, so do I. Okay, you can say, so do I. And then you continue your conversation. Okay, so traten de hacer ejemplos, así, usando me too, y usando eh, so, usando either and neither. Okay, let's do some examples. Después de los ejemplos que podemos hacer aquí entre nosotros, los voy a mandar a una página para hacer unos ejercicios de grammar. Ok. Pero quiero que traten primero speaking. All right. So, let's focus on speaking now. And let's go to the groups. Diego, uh, go to the group, please.
Ok. Eh, un word ahí. Word. Uh -huh. No tengo un falso. Por la ahorita no. Teacher. Ajá. Aprovechando que está por ahí, eh, yo escuché que dijo que iba a enviar algo a principio, cuando íbamos como minuto 10, minuto 15 siempre. No sé si ah, eran como sus, eje Ajá, sus los ejemplos. Los ejemplos que estaban en la PowerPoint. Ya, yeah. uh -huh. eso. Okay. Entonces, sí. Ya se las mando. Ok, gracias. Ok. Creo que tiene problemas ahí, eh, compañero William. Si, eh, si, si gustas, en todo caso, vamos hablando. Ah, bueno, ahí, ahí está ya. Eh, para ir ya escribiendo. Le, le doy un statement. Al final del, okay. video, del video habían algunos. Eh, for example, she says, um, I don't like Indian food. I don't like Indian food. Okay. Neither do I. Neither do I. Very good. What else? Either? How can you use either? Miren el, no, el, miren el WhatsApp. Si pueden okay, ver ahí las fotos. Mandé dos fotos. No, no yet. Ahorita la acaba de enviar la fecha. Uh -huh. Teacher. Uh -huh. No estará confundido. No me ha llegado. Perdón. Tampoco, perdón. tampoco. Ok, perdón. <risa> <risa> Ready, compañeras. Perdón. Para escribir. Ok. Empecemos con esa que te dijo William. Buen ejemplo. Dime. Eh, eh, I don't like Indian food. I don't like Indian food. Write it, please, William. I don't like Indian. Así como se. Eh, es mayúsculo. Ajá. Uh -huh. Yeah. Indian food. I don't like Indian food. Entonces ahí vamos a usar either and neither, right? Yeah. Neither do I. Okay. Ahora. The next one is with with uh, the ah okay. Neither 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 I do. Neither do I. Teacher. Mm -hmm. Aprovecho, eh, cuando decimos neither do I, eh, me parece que en la escritura, yo sé que en la, en la, en, uh -huh. eh, al hablar no, pero eh, lleva alguna coma que sea, ni, o sea, que sea como por ley o como por gramática. Por eh, digo, punctuation. Neither do, I, uh -huh. ah, ajá. neither do I, no, esa sería una oración completa. Entonces, I don't either, I don't either is the next one. Okay. With either. Okay, very good. Ya le mandé ahí eh, example of either and neither and okay. so and two. So you can look at those examples there. Okay. I don't feel like what I. I I don't either. Okay, so sí. a, alguien tiene que dar un statement y los otros van a responder con una de las dos. Okay. So you can say, I like or I, I don't like. like. Mm -hmm. I like to go to the beach. Entonces ahí van a usar so and two, so, right? And two, yeah. Mm -hmm. Very good. Tell me. I like to go. Go mm -hmm. to the beach. Mm 
the the position the teacher. that okay teacher yes. uh, Veronica was asking us what is the difference between either and either. Uh, evil sad is the position, and also I think neither it's it 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 has the negative implicit. Yes, es como decir yo tampoco. Okay. Yo tampoco. So en ese en neither and either lo usamos cuando la oración que la persona está usando es en negativo. For example, no. I don't like sushi. Okay. Uh, neither do I. Neither do I. Or, me either. Okay. No, but, but, but the difference between either and neither is the same. The it's only, the same. It's the same. Son sinónimos. The only difference is that una lo uso cuando mi oración, mi respuesta va a ser en positivo, la otra va a ser cuando mi respuesta va a ser en negativo. Por eso, ah, okay. Okay, don't. Mm -hmm. So, look at, I, in WhatsApp, I put some, uh, I put examples there. Puse dos okay. Y le voy a poner questions, uh, statements. Mejor en Zoom, mejor en Zoom, para no, no mandar tantas cosas en WhatsApp. Ok, an example. You can say, I can't play any musical instrument. No puedo tocar nada. Guitar, drums, nothing. I can't play a musical instrument. Uh... I can't, e I can't either. Very good. That's it. También pueden usar neither, right? Neither, neither can I. Neither can I. Very good. Why? Because my statement, lo que estoy diciendo, está en, 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 es en negativo. Can't. Okay. 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 En el chat le voy a poner otro. En el chat de Zoom. Okay. I, uh, I, I love, I love hiking. Do you know what hiking is? Escalar. Ajá, uh -huh. como escalar, ir a, así, escalar en una, en una montaña, un, una caminata. I, I love hiking. Ajá, uh -huh. Verónica? You have a question? No, no. Okay. No, so, how can you respond to I love hiking? Está en positivo, so vas a usar so and to. I, do. I am too. I do too. You can I say. Do too. Uh -huh. Or me too. Me too. Very good. Or so you can I? say so do I. También. So very good. Okay. Another statement. Um, that I can I can use. I can type very fast okay. in the computer. I don't either. Mm, no, it's a thing positive. I can type very fast in the computer. Neither do I. No, no, neither, way. neither, no aplican porque se, eso solo cuando... Ah, because es yes, yes, it's positive. Mm -hmm. But too. if I can't... <laughs> ah, entonces, uh, allí tendrías que formular tu propia oración completamente diferente y decir... We, okay. we were using, oh, really? I, I can't. <laughs> Ajá, you can say, oh, really? I can't. Ajá, tiene que hacer otra oración usando eh, lo, el pos, opposite, can't. Okay, so what can you use here? I can type very fast. You can use so and to. Okay. I can too. I can too, okay. También. Para decir so I can. Uh, so can I. So oh, can I, sorry. Mm -hmm. Very good, very good. Okay, another, another example here. Uh, that we can use. 
uh, I can't speak French. I can't. Aquí estoy usando un negativo, ¿verdad? I can't speak okay. French. Neither do I. Neither do I. Or can I? Neither can I. Or I, can't can't either. I can't either. Yes. Can't. Mm -hmm. So, entonces hay dos opciones, ¿verdad? Neither, yes. neither can I or I can't either. Okay. If I See? use will, mm. I will... I would like to be sleeping. I would like to be sleeping. Huh? Yes. Yes. I would like to be sleeping right now. Okay. Si ves ahí el chat, ahí le escribí. I would like to be sleeping right now. So, it's positive, right? Ahí no hay ningún yes. negativo en tu oración. So, you, you're going to use so and so. to. So I will. Mm, no. I will like. So would I. So, so would I. Would I. I. Mm -hmm. Or, otra opción. Me too. Okay. Do you understand? Okay, so practiquen escribiendo. You can take some time to write it. Si alguien quiere compartir su pantalla, no sé si alguien está en laptop, no? O algún, alguien tal vez usa un tablet o quiere, tal vez se puede hacer con el teléfono. Si alguien quiere compartir su pantalla y, y, y el grupo va a ver su pantalla y tal vez abrir algún programa en su teléfono para poder escribir. Si quieren hacerlo. Sí. I can share my, my screen. Ok, good. Okay. Um, can you see my screen? Yes. Yes. Okay. I will begin. I don't know if you want. We can. I will write one and then um, Evo and then Veronica. Okay. 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 I can. Uh, I don't know. I can. Uh, Ride by Michael. Yeah. <laughs> I can't ride. Solo ponerle a bike. Ahí. Okay. Okay. Very good. So, which one am I going to use here? Neither and either, right? Okay. Yes. Neither so can I. Yes. Very good. I can't either. So forget that. There. Okay. Yes, very good. Ahí está. Okay. So, the next one. Neither siempre va al inicio. Either va al final. Okay. Okay. The next one is going to be Evo. Hey, let me see. I like to go for me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Yes. Yeah. Uh, uh, I'm talking with the many, many things now with uh -huh. you. That's good. You're 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 yes. practicing English. That's good. <laughs> Thank you, teacher. <laughs> okay. ¿Quién, ¿Quién va a compartir su pantalla para poder hacer las ejemplares? Ah, okay. Pueden compartir su pantalla y pueden uh, hacer. I ejemplo. I don't uh, sharing char because I I use my cell phone. Uh -huh. Ah, Do okay. I use my cell phone, so I don't I don't know if I can share. Pero después tiene que abrir una, alguna aplicación como, como el, ese notepad donde dice notas. Porque por veces hay una aplicación en tu teléfono que dice notas para escribir así. Bueno, aquí en Zoom me parece compartir. Okay. Bueno, lo voy a dar aquí en pantalla a ver si funciona algo. 
<risa> Comenzará la captura de todo lo que muestra en la pantalla. Ah, ok. Oh, Uy, tengo 15%. <risa> <risa> Borra cualquier cosa. Screenshot de teacher. <risa> ¿Qué dice aquí? No tomo el... ¿Por, ¿Por qué no salió esto? ¿Está viendo mi pantalla ahorita? No. 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 Tal, tal vez por eso, porque no estás en, en un dispositivo. Que... Uh -huh. Ok. Bueno, salió ahí que sí lo quería decir. <risa> All right. No problem, no problem. But go to the chat de Zoom. Y allí puse unos, eh, uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cuatro statements. Ustedes okay. respondan a esos. Number one. Ok, teacher. Ok, read so... number one. Ah, en el chat de WhatsApp, perdón. No, en el Zoom. Ah, en el Zoom. Uh, no. Vaya. O se lo pongo en WhatsApp. No, 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 no me sale. Porque no sale ah. nada. Ajá, no, no me sale no nada. No tiene una, una, un, eh, una opción de chat. Ahí es el Zoom de la, de la Sí, pero cuando le ponemos yeah. chat está en blanco la pantalla. Uh -huh. The screen is black. Okay. It's white, sorry. <laughs> okay, no problem. Okay, statements there. Go go to what's up. You're going to okay. see some statements. Uh, uh, lo último. I love hiking. Number one, it says I hi hiking, hiking. Hiking es como trotar. Yes, no ah. trotar, but going in the mountain. When you go oh, in the yeah. mountain. Oh. oh, I never. I hiking. can't hike very fast <laughs> in the computer. <laughs> okay, but you have to respond. I love hiking. Con cuál van a responder? Con so and to, ¿verdad? So am I, or am so, I too? So you can say do. So do I. Ah, so do I. Mm -hmm. So do I. Okay, and so two. do I. Um, and two. Me too. I do too. Yeah, yeah, good. I do too. Or oh, me too. Uh, okay. I have a question for you, teacher. When mm -hmm. that um, sentence is for about that present simple, I use that auxiliary do it yes. for that well, as. Uh -huh. well, usually okay. love, if you see love there, it's un, it's un verbo, it's, a, it's in the present. So yes, you use do. Uh, so okay. Do, if it's an action. Okay, thank yes. you. Uh, the next one. Um, I can type very fast in the computer. Me too. <laughs> okay, good. In this, in this case is, um, so can I. So can I. Or me too, cualquiera. Okay. Cualquier, cualquier oh, can I too? Okay, I can too. too. I can me too. Me too, the other, okay. Mm -hmm. Cualquiera de esas está I bien. I can't Perfect. speak French. In this case is, uh, I can't either. Yeah, uh -huh. I can't either. Or neither, también, ¿verdad? Y en this case, I don't use um, me can't either. No. No es posible. Uh, no, you say I only can't, I can't I can't oh, yeah. either. Okay. I can't either. Or is you some oh. neither? Neither can can I. Uh, neither can I. Neither can I. Very good. So I would can, like to be sleeping right now. Uh, in this case, neither do I. Uh, no, are you a usar to and so. ¿Por qué? Porque la oración está en positivo. Oh, ya. Yeah. Ajá. In this case, uh, so am I. Eh, so would, would. Vas a usar ese mismo verbo. Ah, so would. So would I. Yes. So would I. Mm -hmm. Oh, ya. Yeah. In the, in the two, uh, I would too. Yes. I would too. I would too or me too. Or me too. Come on. Okay. Okay. Like clear for me. Clear? <laughs> ya está un poquito más yes. claro. Yes. 
the exercise in the platform, uh, I put different uh, formats, form, uh -huh. and I don't realize that exercise, uh -huh. but now I clear for me. <laughs> okay. No problem. Okay. Yes. Por eso hice la presentación, traté de hacer algo extra, because it was going to be a little difficult. Okay. Exactly. Uh, remember, if I give a positive statement, we we'll use so and to. So and to. If I give a negative statement, I okay. use either, neither. Neither and either. Okay. Mm -hmm. Very good. But the neither is at the beginning of the sentence or the answer and either at the end of the answer. Mm -hmm. Correct. Correct. Okay. So let's go back to the group and we have five minutes. Voy a dejar con una actividad that we're going to do. Okay. Yo sé que tomamos bastante tiempo, pero ese, ese, hay bastante confusión en ese tema. Okay. Okay. Bye. Ok, very good. So, uh, vi que bastantes estaban haciendo ejemplos, escribiendo bastante, eh, colaborando allí, trabajando en equipo. Eh, los felicito, así se aprende más, muchas veces así, trabajando en equipo. Ok, very good. So, eh, les puse un link en WhatsApp y un link en Zoom. Vayan rapidito a ese link, eh, individualmente. Okay. Alguien está allí ya? Sí. Es un yes, ejercicio. teacher. Yes. Okay, very yes. good. Son 10 preguntas. Yes. Es un ejercicio donde ustedes pueden escribir either or neither. Okay. Okay. Algunas son como una conversación en, en respondiendo y otras simplemente respondiendo así nomás. Okay? Okay. So Y tenemos cuatro minutos, trabajemos en eso y después se pueden quedar ahí ustedes, ¿verdad? Trabajando con ese ejercicio. Ok. No encontré uno con so and to, pero si lo encuentro, yo se lo voy a pasar. Ok, thank you. Thanks. ¿Quién tiene la primera? I don't like pizza. Neither do I. Very good. <coughs> David doesn't live in London. And I don't. Neither. 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 ¿Cuál va al final? Either. Either. Mm -hmm. Very good. Four. Okay, who has number three? John doesn't want an ice, uh, no, John doesn't want an ice cream and the children don't. Either. Either. Mm -hmm.
Ok, very good. Ok, les dejo con ese ejercicio. Ahí lo pueden terminar. Eh, en los próximos 10 minutos ahí lo pueden terminar. Y después vayan a hacer los, los de la plataforma. Ya con, con esto que practicamos se les va a hacer un poquito más fácil. Ok, okay. very good. Questions? Thank you. No. No, no question. Okay, I'll see you tomorrow. Okay, thank see you. you. Okay. Thank you, see you. Very good. Bye. No, no vayan a salir mañana, no sea que con el número correspondiente al dude. <laughs> okay. All right. Okay. okay. Good night. Good night. Bye.